In this video, we will be showing you how to add the Polygon network to your MetaMask. This video is part of a larger Coach Farm DeFi tutorial series. I promise if you watch them all, you will be more DeFi savvy than 99% of DeFi users. There is safety in knowledge, and I want your DeFi journey to be as smooth as possible. Let's get started. We'd like to interrupt the regular programming of this video with a message. The rest of the video, which explains things the old school way, is outdated because Coach Farm has added automatic addition of network chains on MetaMask. Is go to Coach Farm, and the first thing it's gonna do is ask you to add the correct network site. And you say approve. Boom, you're done. You can also do it for any of the other chains we will list on in the future. If you want to understand how an RPC aggregator works, feel free to jump to that section towards the end of this video. But other than that, feel free to skip the rest of this video. We now return to our regular programming. Polygon is a layer 2 chain built on top of the Ethereum network. The Polygon network is known for its speed and low transaction costs. All you have to do is tell MetaMask how to access it. Now, you need to go up to your network switcher up here and go to Custom RPC. We'll be copy and pasting these values in to make sure you get everything perfectly. Now, follow the link I provided in the description so you can copy and paste as well. That is this link right here, which goes to the docs for the Polygon network, which will give you all the right information. Unfortunately, if I click away from my MetaMask to try and copy something, it will minimize the window. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna duplicate this page and move it off screen so that I can copy and paste directly into MetaMask. Okay, custom RPC. Quick side note, on mobile, you won't be able to see that add custom RPC button that I just clicked on. So you're gonna have to click on the hamburger menu, go to settings, networks and add network. The network name is the Polygon mainnet, copy, paste. The new RPC URL is polygonrpc.com. It's recommended and I highly recommend it as well. If you're not currently using this one, please switch over. It will make your life so much easier. I'll explain why towards the end. All right, copy that and paste the chain ID is 137, you can see that right here. The currency symbol is MATIC, uh, it labels it as gas token. MATIC is the native gas token of the Polygon chain. MATIC, and the Polygon block explorer URL is all the way here at the bottom, blockexplorerpolygonscan.com. So I'm gonna go copy that and paste that. Then you hit save. Now you have the Polygon mainnet set up in your MetaMask and you'll show it says zero Matic because I don't have any uh, Matic on my Polygon chain. The next video will go over how to get funds on chain. Before I close though, I'm gonna do a quick explanation about RPCs. Your Polygon network gives you access to your money on Polygon, but it doesn't hold your money. It's more like a road in and out of the Polygon city. I could, I could delete this network um, which should, it should show me a little X right here. I'm surprised it doesn't. Oh, because I have to be off of it. Um, I could go ahead and delete the Polygon network and then re-add it back on and my tokens would still be there because it's a road in and out of the Polygon city. Even if you delete the road, you can always make another one and get back to Polygon to find your tokens, which brings me to the topic of RPCs. And I'm gonna go there right now. I go to my settings, I go to my networks, I go to my Polygon mainnet and I can see my little RPC URL right here. This is the specific street you take in and out of the Polygon network. This specific RPC is great because it's an RPC aggregator. It looks at these like 14 different nodes and picks the best path. Now, if you were to use a different RPC, uh, like one of these for example, they would work but they would be a single road. If there was a train wreck on your road, you might be stuck for hours and your transactions might not go through. If there's a train wreck on one of these nodes, the RPC aggregator will be able to just pick a different one and get your transaction through nice and easy. All right, let's get some money on chain in the next video.